Hey everybody, it's Miss Chris here. I would like to introduce you to my vegetable garden. You can also call it a planter box too. I have two of them. I have this one right in front of me and then I have this one over here. So if you remember a couple of weeks ago, um, I had a video for you of how I planted the seeds. Um, into kind of like little starter sets inside my house because it was too cold and now that it's warmer um a few weeks a couple weeks ago what i did is i transplanted i moved those little itty bitty seedlings um into my planter box outside and the reason why i did that is now they have room for their roots to grow further and they have room to grow out and to grow up a lot more than that um shoe box that i originally had so if you want to go with me on a little bit of a tour Hopefully, I can show you without my shadow. Um, so if you can see right here how I have this string, it's set up like a grid. And what a grid is, it's a series of boxes. And the reason why you do that is so that you know where you plant it. It kind of gives them, um, you're given the space for each of the plants to grow. And what I did was I drew a little bit of a picture um, on a piece of paper that has the boxes. And I wrote exactly what seeds are in those boxes so I know what's going to grow. So here we go. Let me show you. All right. So here it is. So right here in front, these little green plants right there, that's going to be um, zucchini. I have some onions right here. And then I also have cucumber. That's what these little plants that are popping up. These are kind of my favorite and I'm very excited. Um, I've got some little green plants here. I think they're going to be Brussels sprouts and then those leafy ones, those are going to be spinach. And spinach actually is my favorite vegetable. I make a lot of things with spinach and I eat it a lot. So that's why I have one, two, three, four, four boxes of that. And then in way in the back and you can't really see them, I have, um, I have some tomato plants that I started from seeds not growing very fast so hopefully they will be okay and then um in the box behind me i have corn um i have squash and then i have some peppers too i have different kind of peppers so hopefully fingers crossed they grow um i'm gonna be honest with you i'm not very good at uh at growing vegetables for a couple of reasons i either forget to water them so they die that way or I water them too much and plants can die that way too if you water them too much so I'm really trying to do kind of um an in between and figure out exactly how much water to give them so um hopefully in the next couple of weeks like I said I can show you another video or show you some pictures of bigger plants and then even a few weeks after that I'm actually picking them so it's also helping me practice patience. I have to wait. Sometimes that's very hard for me, but I'm really excited because I actually have stuff growing in my planter box. Yay! All right, well, thanks for stopping by, and um, I'm happy that I got to show you all my vegetables so far. Have a great day. I'll talk to you soon.